It's long been believed the first North Americans came from Asia about 13,000 years ago, but a cache of ancient stone tools found in Texas pushes that date back dramatically. NPR reports. What makes these tools particularly interesting is they come from a layer of soil that's below the level where tools from another early human culture had already been found. Those tools were made by people known as Clovis. For a long time, archaeologists have thought that the Clovis were the first American tourists from Siberia. The site is near a spring-fed creek with lots of chert for making tools. It's ideal property for ancient hunter-gatherers. Lead author Michael Waters of Texas A&M explains what they found there. Over 16,000 artifacts, including bifaces, blades, bladelets, ground hematite, and, and various tool forms have come from that lower uh, occupation zone. It's the oldest archaeological site in Texas. It's the oldest archaeological site in North America. So at a very minimum, this site pushes back the age of peopling of the Americas by 2,500 years. This isn't the first evidence the Clovis people weren't the earliest Americans, but there are still a few holdouts of what's called Clovis first hypothesis. Still, the Washington Post explains this newest study is about as meticulous as they come. The Texas finds are likely to persuade nearly everyone. The undisturbed condition of the site, a distinct layer of artifact containing sediment below the Clovis deposits and dating that consistently puts that layer at 13,200 to 15,500 years old is what makes this discovery especially convincing. Pushing human migration back in time raises a few other questions like how did ancient humans get here? Farther than 13,000 years back, ice sheets would have blocked the way over land. The Houston Chronicle takes up the idea that maybe the first American Americans came by sea. There is little archaeological evidence of this trek, however, as such sites would now be underwater. Nevertheless, this theory is supported by modern genetics. If you want to leave electronic thoughts about stone tools, the site for that is right in the comments. For Newsy.com, I'm Jennifer Meckles. Multiple sources, the real story.